Okay, so I've noticed in Camtasia Studio there is a bug with the audio. Um, if you use the wrong kilohertz sample rate or whatever, um, like the 44100 or the 48000 thing for the audio, um, basically if you use 48000, Camtasia gets mad and it makes it all scratchy sounding. So you have to use 44100 or else it's going to sound like this. So this is at 48,000 hertz, and it, it, you can probably notice that it sounds pretty weird by now. I've noticed the louder I am, the more it scratches. So um, I've got my thing set up so I'm pretty loud and stuff, so it's pretty scratchy all the time on this. So that's 48,000 kilohertz. And to compare with that one, this is 44,100 and this is the one that sounds perfectly fine. So, yep. So that's a bug I've noticed in Camtasia, and it's annoying, but to fix it, you just go into whatever program you're using to record, and you just set the sampling rate or the audio rate to 40, 44 or 100. And you may have to do it inside the Windows thing. Let me show you real quick this thing um, you just choose I suggest doing it for everything that is being used so your speakers set it 44 100 48 thousand bad <laughs> bad for Camtasia everything else is fine it's just Camtasia at least for Camtasia 7.1 um, everything else your microphone 44 100 I'm using a weird kind of thing, so I'm putting it my microphone through to line one, so I have to set this as well. For those of you using Fraps to record and then Camtasia Studio to edit, um, here's an example of, of 48,000. Um, you can see in a little thing, Fraps is recorded at 48,000 because I had all my window settings and stuff at 48,000. So fixing that record or fixing all the window settings of 41,000 makes Fraps record at 41,000 and then everything's happy in Camtasia. So anyone who thought their microphone sounded weird in Camtasia Studio but didn't sound weird in other programs, no, you're not crazy. It is Camtasia Studio. So that will fix it for you. And I hope that helps. Bye.